Can somebody help us, please? So remember, we had the final scene here in the end of the first Hello? Jurassic Park movie where the T-Rex and the raptors were fighting each other. And that's why there's blood all over the place and things what are happened? kind of all disheveled. Where is everybody? I have no clue, actually. I... I have no idea. But I'm, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Wherever they are, they'll be back soon. Oh yeah, sure. They're just all getting a coffee break, right? Why not? Hmm. That's not good. That's Jess, even worse. I think you should stay by our patient. I'm gonna look around a little, okay? Okay, but why are you talking like that? I don't really know why he's talking like that either. Someone's trying to contact us, right? It's coming from the PA system. They must be broadcasting on the emergency channel. Hang on, I'm gonna track this down. Everyone's doing tracking. Everyone thinks that they can just find stuff, stuff in here. It's a good thing I know where everything is, so you don't have to actually travel too much. What's this? Nothing here. Nope, just a rock. What's over here? Ooh. It's sickle claw and sickle digit. Velociraptor. What the hell happened here? There was lots of fighting. Lots of fighting and lots of bad things happening, that's for sure. Um, what's over here? Nope, just a bunch more bones all thrown around in different places. You've seen better days, huh? Well, you were hanging up before and now you are fall to the ground. What a mess. Alright, there's really nothing here. Let's head upstairs. Oh, we need to get rid of that PA system. It's Really flipping annoying. All right, good. There's a fuse box over here. To this side, so let's head on in and shut these things off. There we go. What happened? Hold on. Seriously, messed up. Why is that T-Rex head talking? Oh, it was a radio in there. Who put that Can thing? I help? Why? Why would I need help? I just have to reach in and pull it out. That's such a... Whatever. Dumb teenagers. You got it! Let's get this channel right. Yeah, here we go. Zooming in to find the channel's weak. Come on. There we go. Oh, yeah. You're over here. Right? Oh, up, oh, up. Oh. There we go. Hello? Hello? This is Jerry Harding. I'm the chief veterinarian. I know who you are. This is Laura Sorkin. I hope you enjoyed the ride. Dr. Sorkin? You're still on the island? We're stuck in the field lab. The road's washed out and our phone lines are down. What's your story? Things suck. Everything sucks. We're stuck on the island. We missed the evac boat. I'm afraid it's been downhill ever since. Do you know what's going on? Security went down last night. Naturally, the park's going to hell. Of course. Looks like Hammond already evacuated. I don't think he meant to leave us. No, of course not. I'll try to call the mainland from here. They'll send a helicopter. But first, Doctor, I've got a very, very sick woman on my hands. She seems to have been bitten. I, I don't recognize the bite. Whatever it is, it's incredibly toxic. Toxic? And... Is it a ragged wound? Heterodont bite pattern about 20 centimeters across the jaw? That sounds about right. It's all very what specific information that you Did know without Clara actually seeing her. Clonus? Yes, exactly. See? That's exactly Even what more. You don't have much time. She's going to go into a series of convulsions and she won't come back. Do you have any carfentanil? Carfentanil? What? What? Carfentanil? An opioid? No, I, I don't, Doctor, but I mean, what good would that- I don't have time to explain. A quarter mil should do it. Last uh, Dr. Sorkin, small. with all due respect, that dosage would kill Dr. her. Dr. Harding, you've got to trust me on this. You need a powerful tranquilizer How do you know to these things? the toxins. You need it quick. All right, if you want uh, it. all right, okay, uh, maybe in the lab. No, no wait, the trank darts for the rifle. That's an atorphine blend. That could work. Get that into her as quick as you can. In the meantime, stay with her. When the shaking starts, you need to hold her steady. But isn't that dangerous? I mean, normally if someone's having a seizure, you want to kind of like keep them to you know, let them move, but now we got to hold her down Call apparently. Me on this channel after you've given her the tranquilizer. Will do. Okay. I need to move that woman so I can work on her, and I'm going to need... Tranquilizer darts. Yeah, I heard. They're in the car. I'll get them. 
Okay, but listen to me. If you hear anything, see anything, don't take any risks. You just come straight back here. Don't worry, I'm on it. Good. I'm glad that we have such a capable daughter of that can go out to the car and get stuff and then come on back. All right, here we go. A little tense moment. We need to tiptoe our way down. Tiptoe through the tulips with me. Nothing here. It's a triangle. Didn't mean to hit the square. Shaking, shaking. It's okay. We're good. We're good. One, two, one, two. I'm pretty sure nothing actually comes and gets us. This is more just a tense moment because we don't know where anything is. But we made it to the car. And we're supposed to grab the drank darts. I would probably would rather have the gun, but we're going to grab the darts because that's a little bit easier to carry. Oh, okay. What's there? Anything? No? Okay. Grab that crap and run, girl. Go. Oh, music is picking up. Come on, come on, go, 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 get out. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And we made it. Right? Yes. Yes. Get in there. Okay, she's in. I think. Yep, we're in. Good. Thumbs up. Dad, where are you? Just what? get out now. Why? What? Oh, jeez, where did you come from? What door did you enter in from? Ow! Oh, the T-Rex is not like that balcony. How did she not feel the little girl on her tail? Like, when she swung it at her? Alright, get up. Time to move. Wait to the side. Movement. Yes, don't move. Stay perfectly still. I see you when you're moving. Which I don't think is very true, but... <laughs> we didn't know, right? Sweetheart? As okay as okay. I can be. Just stay out of sight. Oh no. Nima's going into convulsions. Hold her down. Hold her down. It's getting worse. Those train darts. Dan, I can get the darts. No, Jess. Just get out of here. I'm not leaving you. No, I won't do anything that you tell me. Because I'm a disruptive teenager, and I could do it because I think I know better. You're not going to last much longer, are you? Uh, okay, here we go. All right, so we have a little bit of a time limit thing here. We need to jump over a few of these columns while avoiding Mr. T-Rex. Or Mrs. T-Rex, I'm sorry. Sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean to call you a sir. I look like a sir, ma'am. Okay, good. We're here. So now we're gonna pretty much be stuck here. We can't do anything else. As much as we want to go get that stuff, we're not gonna be able to. So let us bounce up to where our dad is. And just hold on. Oh, Nima's not doing so good. Let us grab one of these crates and send it right on down to the back of the T-Rex. That'll buy us some time in order to get some uh get those trank darts. Push, Doctor. Get him! Get her! Ow! Oh, she did not like that at all. Okay, we need to go get these things now. Go for it. Run, 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 run. Yoink. Uh, movement. He sees movement. Go, go, go. Uh, up the steps, up the steps. T-Rex thinks she can climb steps. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, look at you. Falling over. Rolling around like a turtle on its back. Still. One little prick in the arm should do it. Boop. All right. Do oh oh wow! Look at that. Well, that was a quick fix. Damn. No, right? <laughs> Why are you acting all dramatic? You just fell off some stairs. No. Get back up and go to eating people. Come on. No, 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 that's too far down. We don't want to be that far down. Come back up, up. Oh, grab. Hold on tight. I'm going to 
There you go, good catch. And uh, not a good catch. It's not working at Tor Vanya. We just had to drop Nemo where we were. It's all right, she's up on the top of the building. No T-Rex can get up there. Unless this is a magic T-Rex, which is very possible. All right. Let's go. Right here. I'm stuck. Just let go, honey. It's not that far. I'll catch you. Okay. I can't. Okay, the final choice in order to get that special achievement is something I've been wanting to tell her all this time. Don't. Be. Stupid. Jess, you're not thinking. Listen to me. There's only one way to do this. Alright, listen to me, honey. I'm gonna count to three, and you're gonna let go. And I'm gonna be right here. I'm gonna catch you, okay? okay count to three. We can do this. Okay. Number three. Okay. Good. One. That's not three! Ow! Oh, boy. Uh, uh, hold yourself up there. Oh, jeez. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You have a head of a T-Rex right by you. Can't be good. Uh, doctor, what, what exactly do you think you were planning on doing by bomb-rushing a T-Rex right in the face? Very sure that that wouldn't do anything good for you or your daughter. There you go. Much better. Shoot it. Oh, wow. There's no trank in there. Maybe if you didn't unload it when you had it before, you would at least have one good shot. Oh well, whatever, we got a bunch here, so... Let's do this! Oh, and that's not a good place to fall. Out of all the bad places to fall, that is probably one of the worst. Whoa! She almost got bit! Let's load it up, everything in, and... Fire! But that's not going to be enough. We have a fully grown adult T-Rex here. We're going to need another shot. Get it! All right, let's try to aim this one for the eye. I bet if we hit her in the eye, she'll really think twice about going with us. We're pretty much at point-blank range, so... Um, um, oh... Oh, man. I spent too long trying to fire. Okay, come on. Let's try this again. <laughs> Our daughter got eaten. Shoot it! There we go. Let's try this one more time. <laughs> Poor daughter. She got snacked on. Good! There we go. Once again, aiming for the eye, or anywhere in the eye region, or anything in order to keep the T-Rex away from her, so this way she don't pull her in and eat her. There we go. Much better. You go take a nap now. Let's go. That's it. Oh, come charging at us. That's good, too. Run, 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 run. In the car. Ow. You still had that on you? Where is the signal? Oh, good. Oh, hang on, the T-Rex. I gotta go and find a signal that I was using before so I can talk to somebody. Dr. Soldier. I'm here. What's happening? I got a plan. What you need to do is help us. And after you help us, start the car. I need you to get the tour car moving. I don't understand. Trust me on this one, please. Start the car. All right, hang on. So now I'm guessing this T-Rex has a horrible sense of smell because it's just based on everything on movement. Like the car's rolling and P-Rex is like, ooh, this looks like fun and I want to chase it. I don't smell too human beings bent over, probably all sweaty from running around and getting beaten the crap out of in front of me. I want to chase the car. Like some ridiculous type of dog. It's gone. Good. Well, yeah. at least it's gone. Yeah. Your mouth didn't move. What? I've seen enough dinosaurs. In that case, let's go home. That's a good choice. That's a good decision. First, we need to figure out how to get well, home because I'm pretty sure everything that leaves the call. island has already either left, sunk, got blown up, or is incapable of moving. How long has it been? We found you last night. We almost, like, ran into you. Dude, that's perfect Zita conversation Seiya. piece. So, who is Marikita? Marikita? It's, it's nobody. A word. Oh, my Spanish is so lame. I was trying to talk to you in the car, and it's like, I thought you were going to kill me because my grammar sucks. 
No, we're just so, gonna um, kill you for other reasons. What did we talk about? Help's on the way. The control room's a mess, but the phones are working. Hey, you look a whole lot better. Help is on the way? InGen is sending a rescue team. A helicopter will be here soon to take us to the mainland. We'll get you looked at by a people doctor instead of a vet. A rescue team? InGen. Yep, My these things. are all I words that we have said. Oh, it's right here. <sighs> Feels like you have some shaving cream in there. But, uh, what bit you? That bite on your arm. What happened? Something in the jungle. Take it slow. Start from the beginning. I'm here for pest control. You have a pest problem. I bet we do. Okay. You know what? I don't have time for this. Whoa, whoa, take it easy. Take it easy. Don't push yourself. There won't be any rescue. Not for you. What? Are you serious? This is how you're going to thank us for trying to save you? Really? Seriously? Ah. Listen up, people. We are looking for two subjects. A Caucasian male, 6'1", in his late 40s, and his daughter, 5'5", 14 years old. They are unarmed civilians, but may be accompanied by unauthorized personnel. There are some really big-ass friggin' lizards out there, so watch your backs and keep your muzzles forward. some after the episode previews of what episode two is supposed to have and for that you'll have to wait until next week in order to figure it out unless this is in the future then you're just gonna go on to the next episode anyway so i know good last time we sat down let's jump into the journal so we don't have to deal with the t-rex jumping around basically as you go through the game you're gonna be picking up journal pages in order for you to see certain things about guys so i'm just gonna flip through a few of them right here just so you can read it for yourselves get an idea on what exactly the journal has to offer i'm only gonna show the first four pages because they correlate to this particular episode otherwise that everything that you're gonna see may or may not ruin it for you as you go through so there you go done finished over you learn a little few things from these things, but that's pretty much that. Alright, so that's the end of Episode 1, The Intruder. Next time we're going to jump on to Episode 2, and we're going to continue the storyline of Jurassic Park The Game. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to rate and comment down below, and if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you can get equipped with me, MetalBlade427. Until more of June Dino Month, you guys have a good one. I will catch you all later.